All right, so I just landed in Edmonton and I'm just waiting for my baggage and I'm gonna go home and take a nap. I did not get to nap on the plane. I just couldn't fall asleep. So I'm gonna nap as soon as I get home, but uh, Steven's here to pick me up and I haven't seen him. So I'm super excited to see him. I feel like I'm gonna cry. I'm like so excited. And to see Harvey, dude, it's like, I feel like he's like a baby to me. Honestly, I just get so stoked about it. So just gotta wait for my baggage. It's been taking forever for some reason, but the flight was good. Everything went really good. My flight was actually early and landed early and everything. So it's pretty much as good as it can get. <laughs> good as to be expected. So yeah, that's uh, that's how, you know, my travel day is going. That's uh, pretty much what I'm doing. Gosh, I think he just put his tongue in my mouth. Harvey! Oh my gosh, Steven said he had a surprise for me and check this out. He surprised me with this all this lighting equipment. So two of these lights with different shields and one of these backsplash things that I can attach different things to. And everything is like on stands. Just a basic white one that he put up for me and another second light over here and these just turn on like that to reflect light. I just feel like I do not deserve this man. I am so happy right now. Hmm. Did you do this to mom? This is what Harvey did to my hand because he got so excited to see me. He sliced it right open. You should say you're sorry. That's what you should do. Look what you did. Look what you did. Honestly stings so bad. But he's so cute, and I don't think he meant to, but I think it's time for a nail trim. Ow, no. Steve and I just went to the pet store to get um, Harvey some clippers because um, this is what he did to me. Yesterday when I got home from the airport, he was so unbelievably excited, and I know he didn't do it on purpose. It's just that his nails are so long, and he was throwing his paws all over the place. And I'm telling you, it like hurts. It literally hurts so bad. It's like infected or something. Infected, it's just inflamed. Inflamed. That's what it is. Um, so yeah, we did that. And now we're just in Wendy's drive through to grab their strawberry frosty. It's new. I haven't tried it yet. Steven has. And uh, he said it's really good. So I'm excited. Um, yeah, I got so much work done today. Honestly, I filmed for like four and a half hours. It wasn't all for my YouTube channel. Some of it was for um, a brand that I'm working with. I just filmed some videos for them. And then I did film a video for my channel and then I filmed a reel next thing you know four and a half hours like good thing is I got up pretty early today so that helped um but yeah I so so much work but I feel good because it feels productive but my back hurts my back's aching my bra too tight my boobs are shaking from the left to the right you like that song <laughs> somebody's shaking his head at me um yeah, we're just getting some frosties. And I broke a nail. Look at that. Look at that. Mm, sis. I am extremely excited to try this. This looks like vanilla. It smells like strawberry though. I actually for a second thought I maybe they gave me the vanilla one. So it just looks pretty much like vanilla ice cream. Yeah, I don't think there's any color. No. There's a little bit of a pink tinge to it. Extremely slight. not great like I think I prefer their other ones it's not as good as the first time I got it it kind of last time I got it had more a lot more strawberry flavor it reminds me of like a certain strawberry like 
flavoring that I can't put my hands on. One that I didn't like, like that really processed strawberry flavor. It's like sour and he'll bite into it and freak out. <laughs> he doesn't know what to do with the strawberry. Wow, my day has been absolutely insane. I have had so much going on the past few days, just absolutely crazy right now. Um, I feel like I've been batch shooting and editing and filming and just like a, a cycle. So really exciting things coming to my channel super, super soon. I'm really excited. Um, some of that might be up before this one. Probably one of the videos will be up before this one. Yeah, so I'm really excited about that. My wound is healing. Freaking Harvey. Um, just crazy, honestly. So I, uh, wanted to remember to vlog. I almost forgot, honestly, just with being, when you're on camera so much with, um, IG and YouTube and things like that, you almost forget that you need to do your daily vlog check-in. But yeah, so I'm really trying to figure out what's for dinner today. I feel like I went to the grocery store and got some essentials like iced coffee and probably junk food. I also got McCain cake because treat yourself. <laughs> I just had some, I honestly do not have this a lot, but I've had sugar cravings so much recently, like the last week, which is so odd for me because honestly I crave salty treats and savory and things, but like sweet, like honestly, I want like Skittles. It's so weird, but I mean, whatever it is, what it is. It's not like I do it a lot. So I ended up getting some junk food. So I'm actually really excited to eat some of that. And Hopefully just uh, watch a movie. Honestly, I feel like I want to watch a movie and do like an in-depth skincare tonight, like with steaming my face and everything because your girl cannot be wearing lashes like this all the time. And my makeup is pretty much off now because I was wearing a mask running errands, so it's rubbed off everywhere. But um, either way, I've just been wearing makeup so much that I'm like, I need some serious skincare. So I'm probably gonna do that. Put on a mask, steam my face, put on skincare, exfoliate, all the goods. Um, yeah, so I'm excited to do that because honestly, I look forward to skincare. Yeah, I'm that weird, but it just is what it is. But anyway, I'll uh, chat with you guys tomorrow. I just uh, stopped at Starbucks, well, a bit ago. <laughs> I've been loving this Grande passion fruit drink. Not Grande, Guava. I got it in a Grande and a Venti cup. Always do this, guys. Always. I don't know if you actually get more drink or not. I feel like you do. It lasts me way longer if I get it in this size. Maybe because it waters down, but it kind of works because I feel like it's kind of made with water with the passion fruit tea or whatever. I've been loving this, and ever since they came out with it, it's kind of been something that I've been getting all the time because I used to always get the passion, the what is it, the strawberry SAE refresher. Oh, I think I got something stuck under my nail. It hurts so bad. Um, what was I saying? The strawberry SA refresher. I used to get it all the time, and now I can switch it up between these two. If you guys can think of any like summery drinks that aren't coffee based, don't get me wrong. I love coffee, but I like to have it in the mornings. Um, throughout the day, like I would love some your hero to a Starbucks order for summer. Or just in general, any ice drinks, let me know. I would love to hear that. Um, yeah. So I'm just, uh, ow. Man, that hurts. There's definitely something to start underneath my nail. Damn, it's like there's a splinter or something. That is not good. Um, what was I saying? Gosh, I'm so all over the place today. Do you guys ever have those days where you just can't even, like, keep a thought because you just keep thinking about something else? I don't know. I feel like that's been my entire day. But um, I am just about to go and shoot some content today because it is beautiful outside. Honestly, it's 17 degrees out right now. Um, I think that's like, what is that in Fahrenheit? Like 60 something? Yeah. And it's absolutely gorgeous. I was sitting out on my balcony this morning and honestly, if I would have stayed there, I probably would have gotten a tan on my legs. Like easily, not even probably, like for sure, because it's so nice. So I left Harvey at home and I feel kind of bad, but I shouldn't because he's so good um, and I have a camera set up in my house and I actually can watch him and he's always either on the balcony sunbathing because he loves to do that 
or he's just on that favorite pillow that I, that I gave him. It was actually my pillow, but he loves it. So I just gave it to him because what Harvey wants, Harvey gets because he's my baby. I love him. So, um, yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing is I'm going to take a few pictures because I need to, um, yeah, there's a few outfits that I kind of wanted to shoot. So yeah, but right now I'm just procrastinating and sitting in my car because that's more fun. I just got home, finished up my day, it was productive. Um, and now I'm making a sandwich and I'm eating my favorite pickles, which are these. Um, do you guys ever just like eat the most random things whenever you get hungry? Like, see, on my channel, you get fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and ASMR every once in a while. But I don't really advertise the ASMR part because I want to like, you know, keep it between me and my loyal subscribers. Yeah. Why is it spicy? Mm, I put spicy salami in there, but this is good. And I'm having these little black pepper rice crackers. Mm. I should put this in my sandwich for some crunch, you know? I'll just show it in there. There you go. I am telling you, if you guys have not tried these Good Vince crackers and you're a fan of crunch, you're missing out because I have never even had a chip or a cracker or anything be as crunchy as these. Like, the 100% crunch. You need them in your life. We have been having the best weather since I got back from my trip. It's just so sunny outside. I was just sitting on the balcony and yes, I had McCain cake for breakfast. I can't say that I've ever done that before, but also I can't say that I will never do it again now that I've done it. Honestly, as a Friday treat, come on. I've done so much work this week. It was so worth it. So I just had coffee and McCain cake for breakfast. I was in the kitchen about to make breakfast and then I was like, wait, there's cake in the fridge. And it just seemed like a good idea and it was. So um, I had that, so that was good. Um, yeah, so honestly, it's you can probably hear the traffic because um, I'm right by my balcony and it's so nice out that I just wanted to keep the door open um and harvey loves the sun oh my goodness he loves laying in the sun it makes him so lazy it's so cute um i'm gonna try to train him a bit because he is growing up a little bit now and he's starting to get into things so i really need to um start training him more than just the basic trainings so I'm gonna try to do some of that today and I don't have any editing. I have a little bit of editing left to do, but I have no filming to do. So honestly, it feels so good to just go into the weekend knowing that I got all that work done throughout the week. So um, I'm just gonna try to go over my to-do list of small things around the house, uh, clean the kitchen a little bit, things like that. Just kind of um, get ready for the weekend. Steve and I are gonna have a date night tomorrow. So really excited about that, but yeah, I'm gonna go and uh, get some work done. I'm just taking Harvey for a walk at this park that we've never been to before. And there's a creek. It's so peaceful. I honestly just love being out in the woods area. Honestly, when I was a kid, I used to go to the woods behind my parents' house and just like pretend that I lived there or something. <laughs> but it's so pretty here. I don't think we can go down there, Harvey. He loves the sound of the water. It's so funny. Come on, let's go around, okay? I just received this PR package from Madam Glam. I'm just gonna open up with you guys. How cute. They reached out to me and asked if they could send me some nail polishes. So these are all gel and they did give me a coupon code, which I will link in the description box for you guys. Um, so it looks like there's a green color, pink top coat, base coat, and a violet color. And then there's this tiny little mini UV lamp. I'm gonna open this up. I'm tearing the packages to packaging, but okay. Oh, so it's like a tiny little travel 
um, UV so I think you can only do like one nail at a time underneath it but how chic is this and I think it stands up yeah okay so it just stands up like this which is cute so Madam Glam and it comes with a little charging port here yeah so that's really cute thank you so much to Madam Glam for sending this to me um, as I said I'll have it linked in the description Steve and I are just at the parlor which is one of our cheers one of our favorite places to go at the patio and the patio season is here y'all so we're just um you know having a date night All right, I just wanted to show you guys what I got at the Sephora sale. So the first thing I got was this um, Benefit Cheeky Tours palette. So this actually, most of you guys probably know about the Hula Bronzer. I have used this one and this one many times in the past and I'm a huge fan. I figured it was just better to buy the palette instead of buying them individually. So I thought that this is something that's been on my bucket list to purchase for so long. I'm so excited about it. The packaging is so adorable. It's magnetic, just so, so cute. The next thing that I got is this Belief Aqua Balm Makeup Remover. I've been wanting to try this. It's supposed to just like melt off your makeup and it's like it's supposed to be amazing. Honestly, I'm extremely excited about this. I'll show you guys. I took it out of the packaging to show you. So it's a hundred milliliter and I just feel like that's a lot of product and it was a great price. So I'm really, really excited about this one. The next thing that I got is actually the Becca ultimate coverage foundation so this is supposed to be really really dewy so i'm extremely excited to try this because i've been wanting a new dewy foundation and i've been wanting to try this one so this is just what the packaging looks like i'll keep you guys posted probably on my instagram story if i love this but really excited this is just my birthday gift i didn't end up going into sephora in march at all so they just gave it to me now when i went in so it's just a mini um, nars lipstick and bronzer i'm sure a lot of you guys got this as well Next thing I got is from the Inky List. It's kind of like The Ordinary. They only focus on one specific ingredient, mostly to create their products. This is the Caffeine Eye Cream. I am so excited to try this because I really like my Ordinary brand that I have, that I use with the um, Hyaluronic Acid. So I'm excited to try this one and see how much I like this. And it's extremely affordable. Next thing I got is just a uh, another hourglass vanish foundation stick i love these sticks but keep in mind they're a very pricey luxurious item but they're worth it i got this in this in the color bisque this time just because i feel like this color will work when i'm not wearing self tanner and mine does not work um that i have right now unless i'm wearing self tanner so i just wanted a second color option and when the sale's going on it's great to purchase these luxury items Next thing that I got is actually just a refill. This is the House of Lashes um, eyelash adhesive, and it's just a refill, so it's just my favorite. If you wear eyelashes a lot, don't even try a different brand. This is the best eyelash glue on the market. I honestly swear by it. And the last thing that I purchased is actually the Brow Wiz, and I just realized that I meant to buy the Brow Definer, so I will re be returning this item because I found a dupe for this one that's by Maybelline that works better and it's extremely micro because this pencil's famous but honestly the dupe is so much better so i am going to return this and get the brow definer steve and i are getting ice cream i don't know if you guys can hear me through this mask but we're at marble slab creamery yummy yum what did you get huh what did you get candy cane and bubble gum like, like, but, but what did you get in it nerds and marshmallows i got um strawberries brownie and sliced almond with cheesecake flavored ice cream i this is my go-to i get it every single time we come here unless they're out of strawberries and i mix it up but it is so good but it's hurting my teeth right now i need to go to the dentist or something like that steve and i are just having lucky charm cereal this morning and look at this so mine's the regular lucky charms and I'll show you Stevens, the chocolate Lucky Charms. <laughs> One of our favorite cereal. I don't know. Do you actually like the red chocolate Lucky Charms as much as I like the regular stuff? No. 
Because honestly, this is... That's your favorite too, though, because this isn't my favorite too. Yeah, why did we buy just so you could try it? Because it was new. The taco ones? Mm-hmm. No, it was like on sale. It was like three for eight or nine or something like that. So I bought three boxes here. Mm. Yeah, honestly, my favorite cereal. So I'm just having that and my coffee. <laughs> There's Steven. I think we're probably, we're trying to figure out what we want to do today because it's kind of, what's the weather outside, Steven? Yeah, from the look out our balcony, I haven't been outside on the balcony. I think I'm going to go check it out. It looks sunny, but yesterday when we checked the weather, it was supposed to be like kind of crappy weather. All right, I'm going to go eat this so it doesn't get soggy. We just got back from our Sunday drive. We got Starbucks. This is the Grande Green Tea Latte with um, vanilla sweet cream cold foam and chai. I'm telling you, I just tried it for the first time and it's my new favorite. It's so good. Mm. You need to try this if you're a fan of chai. Um, yeah, besides that, we're gonna spend the entire day probably just at home for the rest of the day because it's kind of cold outside today. And we kind of got everything done that we need to do, get done. So, yeah, that's what we're doing. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.